And to be honest, I don't think it's funny that thousands and thousands of kids are dying of starvation in third world countries. It's wildly insensitive. It's not really anymore. You f- are we fucking live, man? Yeah, but not in all countries. There's a few blocking us today. Russia. Russia is blocking us or something. Perhaps Canada. Yeah, Canada. Canada probably definitely. Fucking hell, Canada right? likes to block things, doesn't she? <laughs> I'm just getting ready for Rhonda because guess what? Oh wow, yeah. We filled a, we bought a pink wallet, filled it with just the most fucked shit, <laughs> and we handed it in at the pub where Rhonda calls and Arnold Fine called last week, and Rhonda's gonna call up, and some of her money's gonna be missing. There's like a shitload of condoms and like. Tampons, tampons and just <laughs> fucked shit in there man oh. did you it's open be- the condoms or did you just leave them in their packets oh, no I left them in their packets some. we should have oh. yeah had three it in been there too sus. yeah I've been too sus that's like sexual dis- assault or something Matt Brown yeah, yeah, that's sexual assault Sorry. maybe alright um, I went to the good oh, ex- that's exactly right Bosley that's exactly right what's he barking at there was a child outside of my house taking photos of me bullshit about 20 minutes ago a child in your, your in your yard not in my yard, on the corner of my yard. Taking <laughs> photos of you. Did you pose? No, no. He said hello. I said hello back. Speaking then- of posing, we had a little photo shoot today, Matt Brown. I saw- for- hey, Bosley. Hey, Bosley. Fuck Shut you. up. Shut the fuck up. We had a little photo shoot for CB Inc. They're going to put us on a billboard above their tattoo parlor. They're the guys who did our feet tattoos. That's hot. That's at uh, Lutwich, isn't it? That is correct, Matthew Brown. Yeah. It's near my... Somewhere I frequent. <laughs> oh, rub and tug cunt. You go there for pizza and rub and tug cunt. No, I was going to say I live near there, you fuckers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you live you there, live cunt. Near, there. near rub and tug cunt. That's where I get my groceries. Anyway, oh. um, also went to get back to the cardiologist today, got a bunch of test results back. So um, he sort of determined that, yeah, there's, my adrenal glands are a bit overworked. And uh, he recommended that I get on medication. I said, give me another fucking month, cunt. Give me a month to get it down. What, blood pressure medication or something for your adrenals? Blood pressure medication. Okay. So so, yeah. so they determined that there's nothing wrong with my kidneys or fucking my renals or any of that or my heart, which is good. He thinks it's just genetics. But I disagree. I reckon I'm going to be able to get it down without fucking medication. And he's given me, I was low on potassium, Matt. Low on potassium. You know what that is? Which stops. Salt? Bananas. Which oh. stops. Well, it's in bananas. It's in everything. It's, it it's a mineral. Bananas to me. It's bananas? a mineral. Yeah, heaps. I don't know why it's low. But anyway, it stops. It absorbs the adrenal shit in your body too. So he thinks that that'll help. So I've got to get that up. And fucking, I've got a month to get it down. So no piss. Just a little bit of weed. Not much, Matt Brown. Just a little bit of flicker. Little flicker of it. And we'll see. Mm. One month from now we'll fucking see and who knows if I have to go on medication then so be it there's a possibility the people body- that are on those meds do they live a happy life I don't know I'll have to look into it but like he said that my blood pressure it's, it's not like crazy high the average was like 145 over like fucking 80 or something that's not too bad uh, that's not too and when I'm asleep it goes to like 126 over 70 so did but you say it's, your body's it's above not average though. potassium no, it needs potassium to absorb the adrenal shit that makes my okay. heart beat hard. All right, so you need to up your potassium. Yeah. It's bananas. But I eat a lot of like she does bananas and shits. Yeah, but he's given me a prescription enough. for for a supplement. You you need a prescription for potassium at the supplement because you can OD on it. He said. Really? What? So I got to have just one a day. Yeah. Of what? Of this potassium mineral. It's like it's, it's like zinc. It's like magnesium. It's also minerals. But I have to have potassium. But the, you have to have a script for it because you, if you have too much potassium, you can die. Can't? Do you get high? No. Oh. No. It's not like a drug. It's literally a mineral. But it's just they have to have a prescription for it. And also Speaking last. Speaking of. Yeah. Last week uh, I saw a lot of your comments wanting to know what the love the the little potion that the chiropractor gave me. What's in it? And what it looks like. Um, so I thought I'd just bring it on the uh, bring it on and show you guys. Now this hasn't cured my blood pressure. I just need to be clear. This hasn't cured it. It has helped though, pretty a, a fair bit. But my blood pressure still goes high, and I'm not in no way recommending that this should uh, should fucking take over medication or that this will 100 percent work for I you. I am though. This worked for me, well for me. Okay, it's called it's literally called Love Essence. Okay. 
I'll read you the ingredients. <clears throat> Essence prepared by the bioenergetic imprint of a tr- tractor loads root, Romania root, burdock root, couch grass leaf, a st- Astragalus root, star of Bethlehem, rock rose, olive, mimulus, cherry plum, aspen, ruta gravis, fresh plant, and a 25% cane alcohol solution. And there it is. It's a little green bottle uh, with a little fucking squirter on top, and you just fucking like this. You just suck it up. You're only meant to do a few drops under the tongue. Ah, uh, all right. Some? Um, a little bit. It's very hard to get, okay. so I'll give you a little bit. A little tickle. Oh, wow. Yeah, a few little drops, and it just calms your adrenals down, Sour. and it's full of fucking natural shit. So, there you go, everyone. There, I'm holding it up to the camera if you want to see what it looks so like. So, that is the cure for kidney disease. No, well, it, it definitely, no, that's for your adrenals to calm your fucking adrenals, cunt. <laughs> you don't give them false diagnosis, cunt. <laughs> they could die. Their lives are in our hand, cunt. So yeah, good news today, I guess. It's good news medically that it's not something fucked. It's just I have high blood pressure and it's not that high. But he said if I don't address this by 50, I could be having strokes. That's well, pretty that's, fucked. That's, that's 18 no. years. I could be having strokes, he said already. So okay. fucking if your blood pressure is high higher than mine you've probably only got to like 40 before you start getting fucked and if you cause irreversible damage to your heart walls and shit then you're fucked as well so go and get it looked at cunt. address it right you're addressed down heaps there was a comment about that so we'll address it in the questions all right let's yeah. do that the fear comment is that the one you're talking um, about how scary it was getting getting no, when i thought i was gonna die no no someone said that their partner's going through the same uh, thing but yeah they refused. I, you I replied, on it, yeah, yeah i replied to that but i comment. think we should address that on yeah, the yeah on on the fucking question yeah. time count <laughs> Yeah, what address is, uh, just write your address down heaps. Somebody said something interesting as well in the in the comments. I, I know that. you're going to be against this, but is there any chance that that little potion is just and how you're feeling better is just a placebo effect? Yeah, I saw that comment too. What and do you, how do you think about that? And no, I don't think it is a placebo because um, it it works. It gets my blood pressure down every time, and if it if if it the placebo if there was something wrong that was making my heart beat really hard there wouldn't be such thing as a placebo if i had kidney disease and i thought i was going to get better i wouldn't get better i'd still have kidney disease and my blood pressure would still be through the roof so the fact that placebo effect is even an option and placebo effect would work on me proves that there's nothing terribly wrong with me and that something like that would help does that make sense i think so so take that steve jobs but yeah, no, this is, it's, it's, I'm not saying it's like a miracle cure. I'm saying it fucking helped me a lot and it continues to help me a lot. I've nearly gone through two fucking bottles of the cunt. How much is she? It's not much. Like, I don't know, $70 or some shit. I don't really look at it. Can you OD on it? No, you can't OD on it. You <laughs> just on. fucking piss it out if you have too much. Yeah, fair enough. It's, it's just natural roots and shit. Do you have to up your water intake to clean yourself out of it? No. Sorry. It's just, it's like roots. It's like having a carrot. Sorry. Have a carrot. Same thing. Talk to Michael about carrots. Shit, yeah, baby. Carrots. So yeah. anyway, that's that. We have fixed Marty sorted. Well, yeah, I got a month to get it down even further so that I don't have to go on medication. He did want to put me on medication, which sucks. Just I keep writing your address pressure. down. I don't want to be on blood pressure medication yet. You're not doing that. We'll find a better way. I don't believe in that. I think my mum's on it and she's, you know, for, for your age, I feel like you can beat it. You shouldn't, you shouldn't have to take a bunch yeah, of Yeah, I'm confident that I can beat it now too. Now that I know that there's nothing fucking inherently wrong, there's no organs shutting down or my heart's not fucking leaky valve or some shit, I'm, I reckon I can just fucking... Because he said a genetic... He thinks it's just a genetic switch from lifestyle. So my fucking fucked up life has just switched this genetic switch and now I have high blood pressure. So I reckon I can turn it back off, can't Yeah, it's like a light switch, right? Yeah. Well, Let's turn it back off. I don't know if that's how it works, but that's how I think it works. Probably. I think if you dedicate your diet and you change. Yeah, so, but so stick to it. Don't so, fuck yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Continuing the no alcohol and just a bit of weed here and there and then just eating clean as fuck. I've been eating a fuckload of meat again. I saw some people commenting about the carnivore diet. I've been looking into the carnivore diet and fucking hell, I've started upping my meat intake and I gotta say, feeling better are you yeah. mixing it up or is it all just red no it's um it's mostly just all like a really good quality uh steak beef i can't it's a beautiful cow 
Yeah, I know. I feel the same. But like, if it's gonna, if it's between me or the cow, I choose me every day of the week. Well, yeah, that, that every that's fucking day yeah, of the week. You fucking normally. Have I've lived like that my whole life with cows, cunt. <laughs> you fucking dog. <laughs> that's true. And that's our shit talk today. Nothing else has really happened, has it? Oh man, I, I'm just gonna oh. say that oh. you had a tough day out the front. Oh today. my god, I just remembered right now the video that is out on the website. <sighs> Okay. Oh, oh no. Okay, with that before we even like I just this it's probably the most fucked video that we've ever made. Michael okay? mention it. I'm not I'm out. You wait, dude. Julian and Jackson were on a date. I'm not that I'm okay with it. Everyone's making a big deal about well, it. Well, I'm a sh- I, I just you guys felt, are fucked. It's because I felt I felt shame. Yeah, genuine yeah. shame after I, I pushed and, the shame away. And I, I don't think I'd be comfortable showing that to Mum. To Mon, to any of my family members. Yeah, I don't think I'd be comfortable showing a lot of like our vids to those sort of people. But if you just choose to not think about it, just don't think about it. It's like we may as well just fucking do do OnlyFans. You know what I mean? It's fucked, okay? So Michael and I had to make Jackson and Julian vomit on their date. And Michael just really stepped it up really hard. Anyway, it's out now. I don't even. We had to ask. We had to warn the members. There's warnings all over it because this is probably the out of all of the most fucked shit we've done. Yeah, that's why I guess I. A I'm bit not of sorry shame, for what I did. A bit of shame <laughs> involved with that one. I'm not sorry. <sighs> it's fucking like some of our best work. Look, so it is. It is funny, but then it just. I don't know. There's just a, the point. The reaction. Everyone's reaction. Everyone just sort of fell silent. Yeah, everyone sort of like, like, like killed, si- it really yeah, killed the yeah, mood. Julian of was like, "I can't stay in character. Like this is just too like legit. Had to leave. <laughs> he did not. Yeah, yeah he, he was just. Like, oh, that is the best. He really snapped into like. like I couldn't. I, I yeah, really he couldn't do it. Just, How did Jackson go? He was like, he had to ja- leave. Yeah, Jackson they was. Jackson stayed, but just everyone was just quiet. There was no laughter. It was just yeah. like I must what say, okay, just happened. I did feel like it was one of those scenes like. Like where you want to go to your friends like are we all good i felt like, like we've been that. raped i felt yeah. like i was raped <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. i would have laughed like sick, like and ran into the corner at least violated like it was you know. it was funny disgusting most of the video and then the very last yeah 10%. the last part felt a bit wrong yeah just and i was yeah. sick about that yeah I, and I wish i didn't I, I wish i just let you i remember you hesitated i was like i was sort of expecting it and nothing came for a bit and then like finally and I just looked I up don't like and I, could, the I, I, fucking I, I, I know when Marty's sad and I could see in his eyes <laughs> he was pretty sad I didn't want to do it but I did I pissed the shit off his face man I pissed it off his oh, face so I don't want to know sorry dude I don't and it's watch. not did it all come off no no oh, okay. nowhere near it was caked throughout your beard oh. for at least an hour. You walked around. <laughs> yeah, I didn't really have a shower straight away, did I? Oh. oh. Anyway, so we've been filming a lot, and it's going well. Good. We got James on board. We're getting shit done. We're fucking, fucking, fucking baby, and fucking. That's our shit talk, cunt. Let's talk about our sponsors. 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 All right. This. Let's do it. Let's do. You know what? Let's do this. The VPN first. All right, yeah, they, they deserve to go first once manscaped all right just fucking calm down manscaped we're gonna we're gonna switch around every now and then all right what is VPN? God, you've got competition for. now buddy <clears throat> okay so one of our sponsors is nord vpn okay if you want a vpn nord vpn is the best fucking vpn that you can fucking have okay all of the security no one can hack your shit no one can track you matt so matt doesn't want you to get this because he loves to track he loves to find he loves to hunt and stalk nordvpn would stop matt from aggressively hunting you he wouldn't be able to plus you can get entertainment from anywhere in the world right and and um let's be honest australian netflix is shit yeah, apparently the US US Netflix is much right, better. Okay. So you just like, it's like to that so much and then better. you can have a field day. Okay, so if you want this VPN, you can grab your exclusive NordVPN deal by going to nordvpn.com slash fully actual or use the code fully actual, all one word, to get up a huge discount off your NordVPN plan plus one additional month for free. 
Oh my Plus, god. That's not even all, Matt Brown. That's what not else? it, buddy. Plus one bonus gift. It's completely risk free with Nord's 30 day money back guarantee. So that's the thing, right? They're so confident you're gonna love it. You get the you get a free 30 day trial. If you don't like it, they give you the money back. So there's no risk that you're gonna get fucked. I've got it now. I haven't used it yet because it's I'm not very techy, but I will. And I will tell you guys how fucking good it is. And you will use it because we get to use it for free because NordVPN is so cool. And all it costs is a fucking cup of coffee a month. Okay? Yeah, wow. One cup of coffee a month. That's crazy. A small price to pay for premium cybersecurity and access to vast amount of entertainment content. I want two of them. Okay, so Nord VPN, guys, they're they're supporting us by sponsoring the podcast. So please, if you want a VPN, just fucking give them a red hot crack. Let us know. Let us know how good they are in the comments, please. I genuinely want to know if they're good. Because so if please you let us know. Worms, buy it. It helps us out to have sponsors. For this podcast. And we can do so cool can things progress. like like Bachelor Brown. Like hand in fucking wallets. I could be around more. To set up bigger prank we, calls. Yeah, Matt could be around more. We could have more time to set the podcast up. Anyway, enough about that. NordVPN. If you want a fucking VPN, NordVPN is the best. They sponsor a lot of... Uh, yeah, they're, they're actually quite big. They are <laughs> very big. And do you know why yeah. they're very big, Matt Brown? Why? Because they're very, very good. NordVPN! Uh, so the, the link will be in the description on YouTube. And if you don't have the description, it's nordvpn.com slash fully actual or use the discount code fully actual. All one word. Get okay. one today. <laughs> Get one today. Yeah. On to our next fucking sponsor. Fucking Manscaped cunt. <laughs> Here we fucking go, the Manscaped cunt. You fucking use this shit yet, brown cunt? No, not yeah. I didn't take one. Oh, you to. fucking cunt. I used it this morning. And? It was great. Well, not that, this. You used the shaver this yeah, morning. Look how good your stuff. beard is this morning, man. Yeah, I'm going a weird, Michael shaved yeah. himself for a photo shoot today. And yeah. let me tell you, the Manscaped shit is very good. I don't go to the barber anymore, Matt. People were commenting on your current facial hair. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing, eh? He's lost. But anyway, uh, yeah. manscaped.com for all your male grooming needs. If you want 20% off, just use our discount code FULLYACTUAL20 and you get 20% off whatever you need to buy. Shavers, deodorants, fucking shampoo, oh. body wash. They got all sorts of cool shit. Really cool <laughs> shit. They got the nose hair remover. Oh, that's my favorite. That's my favorite too. That's my fucking favorite. I had hairs coming down to my mouth from my nose. Matt! I always found myself pulling them out with my hands. Yeah, you did do and that like, a lot. It always hurt you. And your eyes would water heaps. No more! Mm. Manscaped.com, fully actual 20 for 20% off. And of course, everything here you see is funded by the University of Michael, our subscription website, where Michael smears shit on his face and I piss it off for, oh. for a video. We post weekly videos that we cannot, of course, nowhere near post to social media. They are fucking fucked. They are super painful and violent. They are disgusting. It's fucking awesome. 21 day free trial. You can see if you like the content before you have to start paying. If you don't like it, you can leave free of charge. Fucking link in the description, cunt. 21 days free, cunt. Two, over 200 videos now. That's yeah. a lot, man. Man. That's a, like a good effort and no one can fucking remove them. Yeah, they're there for good. We just had it. Studio 71, the guys who help us on our Facebook keep it monetized, sent through a list of like 50 videos that they want us to remove because they could Facebook could remove them randomly and then we'd be demonetized. 50 of our videos, cunt. What on on the already tamed down oh, social media videos. Fuck. I'm so done with social like media. The ones is that? you've been taming down to avoid. Yeah, yep. Since we started on Facebook. We have a kids channel now. It's children's entertainment. It's Everyone's like always like, school. Oh, you guys are fucking changed, man. It's like, Bluey. no, we haven't. We've gotten far more fucked. You need to just go to the website and see. We can't post what Scott we want to post to social media, man. I'm um, pretty sure. That, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> <laughs> that was cute. Oh. I like that. I'm yeah. shocked that they've sent you 50 videos they want you to remove. I'm taken back. Yeah, I, that's what I did. I saw the email and I stood up and took one big step back and <laughs> yeah, lifted my hands did. like that. And I said, I'm not dealing with this right now. I, I said scoffed. that out loud. James? Yeah, <laughs> <I actually> <laughs> literally. <laughs> 
Yeah, he scoffed so loud and we were out in public. And everyone turned around and was like, what the fuck is he scoffing at? <laughs> I got some attention that day, it I'll tell you that so much. It was so wild. Anyway, that's the end of all the boring shit. Now let's get into the fucking grunt guts of the podcast, cunt. I think it is time, before we get into the Bible and the Brown Diary, for a bit of bong break. Bong break! Stiff neck. Oh, stiff neck. Hals. Mein Hals oh. tut weh, man. Was, was, was machst du denn hier? Oh. And we're back! Alright, we just realized. We just realized, everyone, that we have to do the Bachelor Brown segment right now because Matt's potential future wife. I right, think it is a wife right now. Is, is leaving where she's she's going. She can't talk to us in like 15 minutes. So we have yeah. to call her, Do you love her Matt? right Just now. Just fucking ring Do you want to know her name or not, Brown? No. no. Well, I'll tell you her name is Kirsty. Wow, that is a good name. Yeah, I can tell by the nod that he's like, yeah, fuck yeah, cunt. Do you love fuck her? Fuck yeah, cunt. Just ring her. Oh, oh here we go, her. baby. Do you her love name her, is Kirsty. Just ring her. Look, this... Okay, before we ring oh, her, right. just... Matt, just try... Next... Uh, you always freeze up and get real awkward and shit. Just be <laughs> yourself. Do you understand? Have a normal conversation with her. She's a human being. It's nothing to be scared of, Brown. Push for phone sex. God, yeah. See what you can do with this one, all right? My fly. Look, 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 look. Yeah, Just ring her. All right, here we go, my babies. Oh, this is it. This is the moment, Brown. This oh, is lady number no. four for you, my Brown. Oh, please. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Am I speaking with Kirsty? You might be. Oh, <laughs> well, well, well. My name is Marty, and you're on the Marty Michael Fully Actual Podcast. And right to my left. Yeah, we're very, very, we're very, good. very. We're very happy that you answered because we have a very oh. excited Matt Brown next to us. He's all shaky. He was standing up before and doing a little dance with his feet outside, thinking, "Oh, this could be the one. This could be the one." <laughs> yeah, he shook <laughs> back and forth. <laughs> That's... Is he mincing yet? Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> the mince is churning yeah. for sure. <laughs> but we just wanted to give Matt an opportunity to woo you with his charm. So um, Matt's gonna just talk to you and. Uh, about some stuff and just try and sort of get to know you a little bit over the next minute or so, Kirsty. So um, I'll, I'll, to say. I'll pass it over to you, Mr. Brown. Let's see what you, he's got to say here. Charming, be charming. Don't fuck this up. Try and fuck her. Hey, Kirsty. Hi, Matt. How are you going? I'm good. <laughs> I'm Tell her you love impressed her. with your recent work in the video, you know. Oh, I got so sunburnt from the little hat I wore. Yeah, yeah. No, well, I actually had a really good um, a good one for that whipping experiment because I do CrossFit Ooh. and we were doing skipping yesterday and I hit myself, I don't know, because I can't skip, but yeah. um, hit myself on the arm and I've ended up with a big, like, nice mark like uh, Marty had. Nice. Hit him with the whatever. Oh, oh, so much in common! So much in common! <laughs> Build on that! Build on that, Brown! Where are you from, Kersey? Oh, that's pretty Oh, I'm good. from New South Wales, so Blue Mountains. Blue Mountains. That's close. The Blue Mountains, Matt. Your that's like around the corner. Blue, and they're like mountains. <laughs> so much in common! Mm. Come on, Matt, close it. <laughs> oh, tell her you love her. Fucking on. tell her you love her, dude. What, um, you feeling? Tell her what you're feeling. Oh, if tell we're, her what your feelings actually, are. Actually, no, I got it. I got it. I got it. No, um, if, if, if we were actually going to go on a date, what would our first date be? What He's would you want to do? Who's getting confident? Oh, please, I think... You know, I know you like to stalk and stuff like that, so I reckon we should just watch the neighbours, you know? <laughs> oh, 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 yeah. All right, yeah, oh that's not God. bad. That's not that bad. That's a very good answer, All Kirstie. Right. All right, Kirstie, Thank you. Thanks, a sir. anything that you would like to say yeah. to our Brown to try and stand out? Because there's quite a few Wait, are you a bachelorettes mom? lining up for him. Everyone has been a mum so yeah, far. Everyone's are been you? a single mother so far, Kirstie. Are you also? Yeah. All right. oh, oh, look, you know what? I am. Oh, he loves those kids. Days are, you know, like he loves my kids, kids are getting older. You know, I can just leave them and I can go to Queensland. Oh, that's totally she's fine. ditched the kids. That's always kids. a good, see, good sign of a good that. A nice that should mom. be your Tinder profile. I'll ditch my kids <laughs> if you need. <laughs> 
that along with Cumrag or something like that. Oh. Oh. Things go together. Oh. She sounds like she could be the one. Holy maybe. shit, she sounds so lovely. Now, now Kirsty, if, if you continue um, to get to know Matt, would you be open to it? The no, end of the no season? one's coming, come up, coming no up one's to coming visit here, for though. our season finale no, and no, meeting no, no, Mr. No, no, Brown no, 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 in no, person. We're not doing that. All expenses moving in Stop. for good. I have got my bags packed. I'm bringing the skipping rights so we can try those out. Fucking good. That's good news, guys. <laughs> All right, well, that's perfect. Well, let me pass your details on to Mr. Brown. He will follow you on his personal Instagram, and you two can just have a chat, and, and good luck with it. I really wish the best for oh, you guys. Thanks, Matt. Are you thanks, excited? Thanks. <laughs> it's nice to chat to you all. Matt, say something oh. nice to finish with. Say something nice. It was oh, yeah. nice chatting to you, Kirsty. Oh, boring. Tell her you boring, love her. Boring, Matt. God. Tell her you love her. I'll speak to you uh, soon, Kirsty. Like getting feelings. Going, Matt, it's tell her you lovely. fucking love her. Thank you so much, Kirsty. Appreciate your time. No worries. Bye, boys. I'll see you later. Bye, Kirsty. <laughs> <Kirstie. laughs> <laughs> you, you just got married. Stop. Dude, it is Stop exciting. That was you fucking her then. That is exciting. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Do you love her, you reckon? That is not a shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, how's the other one's been going? How'd the one from last week go? Sammy? Uh, I don't have any contact stuff from her. No one sent me oh anything. Oh my God, I don't, you fucking- If she followed me, I didn't pick it up. You are so fucking annoying, man. <laughs> okay, follow. Oh, man. I'm going to message them all, all right. right now. No, no, not but, all of them. Not all of them. No, just fucking Kirstie. Instagram, Matt Brown. What? Matt Brown and four ones. I need I'm to change that. I thought four. you were going to yeah, make me really a new do. one. Matt, is yeah, it, why have you got four ones? Because that was what was available. Okay, okay look out for this, this Instagram, okay? She's going to follow you. You fucking talk to her. Oh. Do you understand me? I know who this is. I've seen her comment before. Oh. Wow, they've already been speaking. Oh my speaking. God. They've already been He's speaking. He's had an eye on her already. <laughs> she actually is very lovely. He's been watching her. Oh. oh. She messaged before Brown. She's the one. She's also got a child, Brown. They've all got children. You love children, Brown. And Sammy and the other girls, you have to continue to talk to the Brown, okay? Don't give up uh, he's he's put this wall up because he doesn't want to get hurt it's okay if everyone gives up uh, honestly I just I'm sick Persist. of seeing him so sad and so down and alone and nothing to do but just watch hours of porn intense porn he has to pay he has to pay because his tastes have gotten so fucked <laughs> <laughs> please <laughs> Just continue to talk to him. He's a nice, nice person. At the very center of him, there's a shack of niceness. In the very, very middle, everything else is just freak. It's like deep in a liver. <laughs> you have to water the seed. There's a little seed of love in him. And he's just fucking following us around. <laughs> oh, it's ready to like grow. That good. Fuck, man. I reckon fatherhood and Kirsty. We'll do it. I don't pay for porn though. Okay. Okay, well that's good. It's not that bad yet. Still, so I'm pretty sure Kirsty's the one. Man, so that would you, you agree? You guys, you guys had like a weird energy chemistry. You both like whipping? She had jokes and you were laughing. He was laughing. Well, she did genuinely say laughing. <laughs> yeah, not your polite really laughed. laughter. That was real life. Real then, brown chuckle. <laughs> 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 oh yes oh, oh. Well fuck it We found the one We don't even have to do the comp anymore We'll just move her up here You said that no, this No no one's work. coming up No no three at the end of the season No one's moving in I with me we Matt, just move I'm not going on good. behind the wall Listen to sounds and pick one I'm not doing it I think Kirsty is in number one position at the moment But purely because the other girls Haven't continued to crack at the wall Keep going girls Keep messaging I think keep I was crying. meant to message Sammy Is that what the hell that works? Yeah yeah you gotta know. fucking oh. I don't Man, have that. It goes both ways. You but to, at least it's getting to, better. Yeah. After this, I'm going to give you a fucking Instagram. Start to, Sammy, come on, message him. You see all your requests in your Instagram, right? You oh, yeah, I'm on all? top of that. I yeah, have OCD. Well, there you go. I'm not like you guys. Message him. Matt Brown, 1111. Oh, I've got to change that now. It sounds horrible. Four of the Still, number ones. Yeah, that's a I'm terrible. pretty sure we're getting closer to finding you the one. 
which is exciting. You said this wouldn't work. So it's not working. We're five episodes it's in and we found a bunch of very lovely eligible ladies whom have children. So you will never starve. <laughs> Children. <laughs> you can eat the children. <laughs> Held them by the ankle. Oh, oh no, bro. <laughs> no, bro. <laughs> 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 Bachelor Brown, ladies, if you want to talk know, to Matt, but, Matt Brown, message them at Marty and Michael oh, Instagram account, okay? Can you stop putting stories of it? If you want to date Matt Brown, why don't you message? <laughs> Sometimes we don't it's have enough numbers. Fun. It's not fun. It's embarrassing. People at my work are going, hey, have you seen this? <laughs> Just, just tell them that we're doing it as a joke. Yeah, I've said uh, as many things to, you know, ref uh, deflect the, when they show me. He sweated on me. It's okay though. <laughs> it's gonna it's gonna help you find yeah, the dude, one. You you will laugh about this at your wedding. But anyway, any girls out there interested in dating Matt, DM the Marty and Michael Instagram account with your number and be available on Tuesday afternoons, all right? Or evenings, because that's when we do this year, baby. <laughs> Mr. Brown, everybody. <laughs> on this day. <clears throat> On this day in 2021, Putin was playing with Joe Biden on a playground during a visit to the US. Putin even brought along his favorite toy, a big Spider-Man figurine that he got for his 50th birthday. Putin shared his toy with Joe and Joe excitedly ran around the sand pit playing with the Spider-Man. Putin had other toys but wanted his Spider-Man toy back after seeing the joy in Joe's eyes. Joe said, just a few more minutes, Putin. I'm in the middle of a fight scene with this Spider-Man. And Joe threw the Spider-Man up in the sky. It fell and hit the ground hard. Putin rushed over to it. One of the hands from the Spider-Man figurine had snapped off. Putin filled with rage. You owe me a new Spider-Man, Joe. Have one of my Batmans, Putin. Stop being so uptight. <laughs> Batman is a sheet. You will pay for this, Joe. Joe shrugged and started playing with some toy cars. Ever since that fateful day, Putin has only ever requested that Joe rightfully give him a new Spider-Man. Tensions grew and Putin finally invaded Ukraine because there were some Spider-Man figurines there. He will not stop oh until God. Joe gives him a Spider-Man. Are you fucking kidding me, cunt? <laughs> oh That's what this God. war is about? <laughs> If anyone has any fucking Spider-Man figure in, I'm pretty sure I have some. I used to. That's crazy, you man. You go to a garage sale, you'll get a bunch. This goes to show the war is never about what you think it is, right? It's fucking crazy. It's about fucking Spider-Man, Matt. Is that confirmed? Is that confirmed, that, yeah. on this day? It's never the you narrative did, you they did say, the spy work. Okay, Ben? You did the spy work on that. <laughs> <laughs> you Were you there harvesting? Were you harvesting? Harvesting? Okay, yeah, harvesting that day. You would have been harvesting. Harvesting. Yeah, harvesting children. You oh, harvest them. Like the oh matrix? My God. Yeah, yeah. Holy shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is intense. Yeah. We'll probably have this video restricted now. Everyone remember that that's just a joke, okay? Just relax. If uh, we we don't like war and we wish everyone would just be happy and friends. Now shake my hand, Mr. Brown, and let that be the end of it. I'm back. I'm taken back. You're being COVID safe. Scoff. <gasps> hey, Michael, did you notice that Marty's been trying to get in on your footrest a couple of times? Yeah, he That's sweated on me before. Yeah, look, I have the... I have, of yours. Look how fucking look, wet I've, his yeah, leg is. My leg is drenched in sweat. It's like a so thing it's in like, Germany. It's like having... They're always yeah. just saturated because half of it's underwater. It's my, <laughs> it's my weapon. I can just take whatever Fuck territory off. I want. <laughs> <laughs> That's what Germany does. This is like my, it's my nuclear weapon. Everyone's just sick of you watering the room. Look at that. That's mine now. See how I did that? Yeah, That's it's why quite you and Now you have to impose sanctions on me. You're like a fish. Do -do -do -do. Hey! <laughs> oh, you're annoying. Oh, 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 he's been doing that shit all day. Do -do -do -do. Just pokes at you, then goes really intense with his eyes, and tongue goes up and down. It's frustrating. Michael's Bible. Oh, I brought it. Thank you, Michael. Brought his Bible for once. You want to see what Michael's Bible looks like? Here it is. Oh, oh angelic 
sounds. Uh, we should record uh, angelic uh, sounds and then but pa- us do it for in together for the segments. Uh, Alright, I'm just gonna flip to a random page in the Bible. What's Ooh, this? What fell out what's of there? This, what's huh? that, Michael? Oh, the condom. Dude, that's oh, you're cheating God. on Amber. You're cheating on Amber oh, with that. My Sacred God. knowledge. Alright, I have found the verse that I would like to read. <clears throat> Chapter four, verse twelve from the book of Here is There. It's a good one. Here or there may seem like different locations, but you will always only be here. There turns into here when you reach it. Therefore, there is always out of reach, and here follows you forever. Stop searching for there, because there is just here when you get there. Just accept that you are here, and there is here too. All you have to do is go there, and it will be here. (laughs) Huge sparks came out when I threw a rock at the ground. (laughs) Wow. And it makes sense. Stop chasing <laughs> what you already have, I guess, is the message there. Okay. Well, and there will always be here because yeah. it's just eventually like, there. Like you can, you know, oh, over there is the kitchen right now. But if I walk there, Ooh, it's that's here. now here. Yeah, I get it. Do you get it? Oh, that makes and, sense. and we're all here right now. So don't even look over there, Matt. Don't look over there, Matt. What the fuck? If you tie a piece of metal to the end of your car and drive, you can at night time see light. You can see little sparks coming off that, all right? If you do that, if you tie it correctly, little sparks will shoot off into the night sky and it will illuminate the road. It looks fucking cool. It looks fucking incredible, mate. Shut up. And that's why he's Beezus. Yeah, dude. But the book's pretty cool. There you go. Oh, yeah. We'll get a photo. Start selling them. All right. Oh, here we go. All right. Do I dare? I'm relax for this. Do I dare oh. pick up the book of? No, 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 no. It's time I can to feel enjoy. it's evil. Oh yeah. Oh, it's, heavy. it's so heavy with sick. Oh, it's heavy with guilt and shame and oh sadness. Oh, there's so much ejaculate spread across the pages. Oh, oh yuck. Oh, there's music. Somehow you've put music in here. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yucky, 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 yucky. Okay. <sighs> All right. Yucky, I've, yucky. I found <clears throat> Matt's little black book of halves. How many halves do you think I've had? I don't know. Put your I guesses looked in the through comment. the book. Yeah, Put your have, guesses in the comments. Yeah. How many halves? Yeah, that's a great idea. I think you've. Had. Why don't you comment? How many haves you reckon the brown has had? And we'll see if anyone's correct. We'll give you fifty thousand dollars. I guarantee you, you won't be. Yeah, it's hard. <laughs> <laughs> Have number thirty-seven. <laughs> I was volunteering at my local aged care home. I enjoyed watching the elderly struggle to do basic everyday chores, and the fact that they relied on me to help them had an aphrodisiac effect on me. It was lunchtime, and I was spooning soup into a 94-year-old lady's mouth. She was incredibly brittle and tiny. She had a permanent hunch and weighed less than 40 kilos. I enjoyed feeding her. I carefully balanced the soup and slowly brought it to her mouth. Sometimes I would purposely spill a little down her chin and let it dribble onto her upper chest. The spilled soup would start to roll down her top, and right before it did, I would stop it with my finger and slowly mop it, mop it up all the way back up her chest. Then I would lean in close to her and sexually suck the soup off my finger, only centimeters from her face. Mm. The extremely old lady laughed nervously and leant back. Once lunch was over, I took her back to her room. The old lady had lost control of her bowels and had soiled herself. Her nappy was filled to the brim with liquid shit, and it wobbled over the edge and ran down her legs. I felt my little brown stir, but I pushed my lustful thoughts aside. I took her to the bathroom and removed her nappy. Shit slopped on the floor, and it smelt of Greek corpse. I resisted the urge to dip my testicles in the mess and started toweling the shit from her legs. Oh dear, what a mess, Peter. Peter, I'm Matthew Brown. (laughs) Don't be silly, Peter. I know your handsome face better than anyone. It had just occurred to me that this old slag was having a dementia moment and thought that I was her late husband, Peter. 
I felt my blood pressure rise and my meaty body started to swell. I began sweating profusely and my urges were getting the better of me. I sensually started wiping the shit off her legs and worked my way up to her ass. Once there, I pulled her saggy cheeks apart and slowly but firmly started wiping the towel, wiping the towel up and down, making sure to apply a little extra pressure as I ran over her asshole. <laughs> oh, Peter, you're still so cheeky after all these years. I quickly stood and pressed myself against her back. My mouth was right on her ear and I whispered, Why don't you let Peter get real cheeky, darling? <laughs> oh, Peter, take me now. Consent! I screamed. I immediately started tonguing at her ear and ripped off her top. She was now completely naked and her tits hung like pool balls in a pair of stockings. I picked her, picked her up and placed her on the vanity in the bathroom. I I pulled her legs apart and my little brown was already eagerly throbbing. I stabbed at her gap, but she was completely dry. I looked around and saw the shitty mess on the floor. I bent down and grabbed a scoop of her shit and rubbed it all over my little brown and fingered a bit up the old lady. I thrust it forwards again and entered her century old box. Oh, Peter! She gasped. I ripped her legs fur further apart and fucked as hard and fast as I could. I stared directly at her hanging tits as they violated I violently shook around from the force of my pounding. I was getting close, but slipped on the shit on the floor. I fell backwards and took the old bitch with me. My back slapped right in the middle of my shit, and the old lady fell with her chest on top of mine. I grabbed her ass and continued to fuck aggressively. Shit splattered onto the walls around us, and I rolled over into the, onto the shit. I positioned the old lady into doggy position. I grabbed two fistfuls of her stretchy elastic back skin and pulled her back into me so I could feel her at maximum depth. Her breasts were hanging in the shit and I could hear the surprise in her voice at what was happening. Oh dear Peter! With one last thrust my little brown opened up and I released a huge amount of mint. With incredible force I came over 15 litres of ejaculate mint. I let her flop onto the shit covered floor and disconnected my little brown from her. I placed her in the shower, scooped my mints out of her with a ladle and cleaned the bathroom. I could not believe this conquest. I truly am a king. Bow to me, you fucking cunts. <laughs> that raises um, a lot of <laughs> ethical questions. Why do you tell people that? Oh my God. Why do you have that written down, cunt? Oh. You wrote that personally. Oh. That is a personal recollection, man. That is fucking intense, baby. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Dementia, you used man. Shit as lube, and you fucked a dementia lady while she had a momentary <laughs> lapse. You fucked a demented lady. Man, I don't know if we That's should even sad. put that out there, baby. Oh my god! Holy fuck, dad! Shit, that was so priest. Her tits hung like pool balls in stockings. <sighs> oh. Oh wow! Is, is that, no, they didn't. That visual oh. representation. You can you see that? That's not what I remember. Oh man! Oh Peter! Oh Peter! <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. That was fucking. Thank you. That was a good time. Uh, before we get into the questions, I believe it is bong time oh, yes. bong break bong break bong break bong. <laughs> and we're back <laughs> oh, we're back now and everyone Matt Brown doesn't have his headphones on yet so we can <laughs> Watch him struggle around in his small egg shaped chair. And he's putting Are them on. Are you now. liking that one more than the blue one? I don't know. Is it nice being lower to the ground? Is it like more earthing? No. It's not. I feel like I'm too low. But Must be a bit cooler down there actually, though. If surely. I sit up straight and my back hits the top of it, I it's a bit more comfier than the blue chair. Okay. Well I'm loving it as my footrest now. It's good. It's comfy. So comment of the week? 
Yes, please. The cow, everyone. And uh, anyone and everyone can get a, get a comment of the week. Okay. We have a special board, Matt. You want to show everyone? Where I we added zero and uh, f- um, last week's on fly by okay. night. So we choose, the three of us choose the comment of the week. Doesn't have to be the most liked. Doesn't have to be the funniest. Doesn't have to be the cleverest, whatever. We just pick one that we like there and then. Okay. And fucking we've picked, we've picked one, right? Or Michael's picked a top fucking three Michael or something. Michael found shit. one. Oh, yeah, that's right. We have picked one. So Matt will print this comment. If you want your comment to be comment of the week, by the way, just comment something funny, something cool, maybe like a little poem or something. I don't know, man. Just something random. Anything can get us. Doesn't have to be the most liked, so don't be disheartened if it's not the most liked. Yeah, this one has no likes yet. We we answer questions that are the most liked, though. So if you want us to answer your questions, then, yeah, they have to be well liked because that means people want to hear the answers. Anyway. Comment of the week. Goes to Ash Hole. Ash Hole. It's mm, a creative hole. name too, baby. H O L E Hole. Yeah, that spells hole. Hole. Same thing. It's like German <laughs> He's hole. Used to your worker name. Hole. Some. Um, all right. Uh, comment is only Brown would get sunburnt in a beanie. <laughs> <laughs> and last week was fucking good. Oh. If you watch last week's podcast, oh. especially towards the end, because he gets more and more sunburn as we go, as the episode goes, he was oh. fucking red as cunt. It was, it was very so good. embarrassing. And because of the <laughs> hat, it was like a perfect line <laughs> across my head. Why were you wearing sunnies? I don't know. <laughs> oh man, it was the perfect hat for it. It just started it was a out chef's with hat that he wore. Yeah. Someone commented that was for a and said, vid. "It looked like you were pl- you were auditioning to be in the James Bond movie, <laughs> yeah. like the villain mm. <laughs> with the glasses and the sunburn jump." Yeah, I looked very marked. good, guys. Uh, we've been going through as Marty and Michael and and just thumbs upping your comments um, and, and replying and to replying. A, replying to a few. So just keep the comments coming. We do read every single one. We love our podcast comments. I sit there at night and I fucking chuckle my fucking head off, gun. People are very creative. Yeah. So weird to have them understand how you talk and And all your little things and And the humor, the very specific humor. Especially with sorry when we're like, oh, sorry. And they go, sorry. And they start to, uh, they start (laughs) to pick up. Sorry off. Sorry. Sorry off is good. Sorry is taking over the world, man. Well, yeah. Everyone needs to, well, that's not really paying it backwards. Um, um, one of the comments was the most liked um, from It's Manly. They said, best podcast in Muddy and Michael. Nobody has the creativity or humor like these guys. So thank you for that. And that's also, yeah, that's a fact. So no wonder it has so many likes. It's been but, a fact um, check. It's so fucking good. All right. Um, oh, we are so fucking good, man. All right, it's on to the fucking questions. I can't believe how good this is. We're pretty rad. This is, we are so entertaining. I tell just everyone three, I'm the best at work. Just three cunts in a in fucking his basement with I'd rats we're surrounding us. Top 10. Mate, you, Michael, you didn't tell your rat. You nearly got attacked by a rat. Oh, that's oh, yeah. right. Go on. The destruction, all the stuff that was like left over after our website video that was the most fucked we've ever filmed. I put in, all of that stuff in a bin. And there was like, obviously we spoke about it, human feces and like, like urine and lots of other shit. And a $50 vomit. note. Yeah. Oh yeah. There's a $50 note in there that we sort of accidentally threw out. So he's looking for it. I was looking for it. And then a rat just jumped out <laughs> literally 10 centimeters away from my head. It attacked Matt. you. It was like right here. You heard the scream. <laughs> and then I like, it, I had to sort of dance with it because it was going from right foot to left was foot. Was it trying to attack you? Well, look, yeah, a little bit. Cause I was in its path oh. from being off balance, falling back. And then I got oh. out of the way, came back to reality and was just so like, if they bite you, is that bad? Yeah, you can, you can get rabies and shit. Yeah, become a rat. Plus really? it's sitting in shit infested fucking farms. Oh yeah. The rats are turning on him. Uh, next time, try and film them because oh, yeah, I want to show tried, everyone. Well, we yeah, we went to. in the garage today trying to film any. some. Because like, they, they still they haven't been today. able to infiltrate your house though. Yeah, they There's only no, hit the borders. Yeah, they're all like around they're the outside. Like the, the garage, the patio. They've, they have us surrounded. And yeah. they're like, turning on you. I like can't believe that. That is terrifying. They're turning on Michael, the king of rats. Why did they start talking to you? It's like a full revolution. I hear him in the roof. Michael. Why are they not liking you At anymore? Night. They scuttle. It fucking creeps me out. <laughs> Maybe they want, if you let them in, 
They're probably running. Fuck that. They're probably running from the four pythons that are slithering around. Oh up man, there. it would be so funny if someone accidentally left all your doors open. And Dude, shit. I always shut them when anyone's about. Like I make sure they're shut because it just take. They did quickly come in. How funny would that be if someone accidentally opened all of that and funneled the rats into his house? Wouldn't that oh, be? Oh, I see what you're a talking good idea. about. Wouldn't that be funny if that happened one day? <laughs> yeah, that's gonna be hard. To <laughs> <call>. <laughs> Oh, Ooh. Ooh, okay. Mm, special idea come. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Mm, question. Yeah. Top question went to, oh, fucking names. Oh, uh, come on, man. Have a go. Okay. Jasko or Yasko, depending where he's from. Oh, so be racist. Yasko. Racist. I'm a rat. Depending on where they're from. It doesn't matter where people are from, Matt. Everyone's the same. We're I'm all ragic. equal. No, but we're pronouncing. So God. Right. That's our man. I'm a, I'm a ragic. I'm a ragic. Here we go. What is it, Dr. Jones? Anyway, um, question is, um, Marty and Michael, have you ever had to cancel a recording of video because of how scary or painful it is? And from what planet is Matt Brown from? Yes, dude. We were talking about this the other day. The fucking, remember the magnifying glass tattoo video we wanted to do? ever. And there've been just some videos we filmed that were just too shit to post. We played catch with mouse traps. I still have scars from that. (laughs) We didn't even post it. Yeah. It was so painful. I wonder anyway. if we could do it now. Yeah, and there's things like we had to cut the other day because Julian was out of character. He's like, I don't want to film anymore. Yeah, but like full videos that we've had to abandon. There's a few. There's a few that we've they've just been like, no, nah, this has to just, we never speak of this again. That we went to- um, We, we tried to recreate post- the Big Bang. Yeah, that one. We went to um, Bounce and Michael learned how to do a backflip. Oh, in, that in was it. We'll post we still, that eventually. We still might use that. Julian hates That it. was so fun. I learned my first backflip. Have you ever backflipped, Matt? Yeah. It's Show so me. fun. Show it changes me. everything. Show me. We'll do it after. All right. On a trampoline, it's a whole different story. But yeah, I'd like to post that. The big, I want to, okay, this goes back to the Big Bang video. I've thought of a video we can do. Let's recreate the sun. So we'll buy, oh, the I'm sparklers. talking so many yeah, sparklers. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know this one. I know this one. See if we can recreate the sun. That's a great idea. Yeah, we will do that. We will 100% do that. That would be a great science day. It'd be like the microwave video, except yeah, it'd funnier. Yeah, be fun. It'd be so bright. Yeah. All That's right. Fun. Next question is from Gyrex. Um, <laughs> depending where they're from, though, right? Depending man. where he's from. God. Could be, could be Gyrex. <laughs> <laughs> um, Ma, uh, it's a bit of a serious one. Um, Marty, what did you feel when you thought you might uh, die due to your health conditions? What What did you go through? What was your thoughts? Look, it is uh, it is honestly fucking terrifying. It's the most scared I've ever been. It's the it's your fucking you think fuck this is it you're gone skis now all the bad shit you've done and you wish instantly that you could redo all the dumb shit that you've done. So just I'm not saying don't fucking party and have a good time, but I'm saying maybe just cut like the, take one or two less take caps. like ten percent off the top that you usually do and just fucking chill Instead out. of doing the hard drugs, smoke more weed. Yeah, weed. You guys got weed now. Like, have fun with weed. Like, but don't start smoking too early because then you end up like fucking all fucking their head and shit. <laughs> <laughs> Me? Yeah, only on holidays just start gesturing early. gesturing to... I was just, it's just how I talk. Next question is from Joshua Tiller. Tiller. Um, um, how do you think you'll be before you can't do stunts and experiments anymore? What's some funny sh- shit you think you could do as an old man? I, I think like 50. Well, so yeah, the shit we do right now, but we'll be able to do other hilarious things. And also, I also do think it we, it gets funnier the older you get. Yeah, he adds yeah. in here, will you just be 80-year-olds still drinking each other's piss exactly. bags? Exactly. Dude, imagine you doing imagine squirties that. at like 80 years old. <laughs> just be shit and blood. <laughs> <laughs> be shit and blood. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and a bit of your cum. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh, but yeah, the older we get, the funnier it is. I can't wait to be an old man. You just do whatever the fuck you want. Yeah, it would Literally be fun. Whatever you want. Imagine just falling over to scare people. Or but setting your arm on fire it. as an old man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I would piss myself yeah. if I saw that. <laughs> You just do all sorts of shit. Oh, man, it would be You could be just fun. eat food without using your hands, just your mouth. <laughs> I was just seeing an 80-year-old do that. Yeah, true. You could you get licensed to do whatever you want. 
Being old is like sort of You can of tell cool. people to fuck off and shit because no one's going to bash an old man. You kill him. <laughs> yeah. You can say whatever you want, whatever you're thinking and feeling. <laughs> oh, you look fucked. <laughs> Surely that wheelchair is not needed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. It does give you a license to do whatever you want. Oh, oh, next I'm question sure. is from David. Depending um, on where he's from, right? Where he's from. Um, has- <laughs> yeah. What was that, Clay? What was that? Where did that come from, my Flay? Did you throw- call me Clay? Did you throw that? <laughs> yeah, I flipped out of my ringworms. That's crazy, man. Look at that. Isn't fire weird? Like, yeah. what the fuck is it? You just... It's a chemical reaction is what it is, but like, isn't it, isn't it strange, Matt Brown? It's just super hot in that one little area. Let's have a comp to see who can touch it the longest. Starting now. One, two. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> dude, that was like three seconds. I'm not even gonna try and oh, eat Please that. have one turn. <laughs> please have one turn. Ow. Dude, it Fucking instantly burns. Uh, I guess you oh. could, you turn okay, it off. I ruined it. Next question Sorry. is from Swamp Box 69. Oh, Swamp Box. We've all had that. Depending where he's from. What would um what would be your weapon of choice if you guys were stuck in a zombie apocalypse? Um a nuclear like a machine bomb gun? Yeah, a machine gun or a nuclear bomb. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, a machine and you gun. You need a shelter if you got a nuke. Or what about something that doesn't run out of ammunition ever? A, a, a fucking Julian and his fucking little knife. Stab, stab. Yeah. Oh, true. Because as soon as you run out of bullets, you're fucked. So maybe a machete. Yeah, or a really long, um, something really long uh, like and, a and quite, quite light, so that I could cut um, still cut through them, but at a quite a distance. Like a small sword. Well, quite a long sword. Yeah. yeah, so yeah, I'll see. I'll see what I can do. Like I'll uh, try like and have f- one made. Yeah, yeah. If, if, if you'd want a short one, yeah. like a fencing sword, you'd want something so you can hit him when you're further yeah, away. My weapon for a zombie apocalypse. I want a fencing sword. Cunt. <laughs> oh. <laughs> poking him in the eyes and shit. Cunt. <laughs> 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 Don't, don't do that. <laughs> you scared me. Next question is from Richard. Map around, your mince seems like ma- it's magical. <laughs> would you ever sell a sample and what would you deliver it in? <laughs> P.S. Love you, grubs. <laughs> um, would you deliver Richard, it in? Uh, no, I would not sell my semen. I, th- I think a good um, thing to contain your mince would be like maybe a uterus. You could get different animals, uteruses or women, if you really want, and then keep your mints in there, and then that's how you would gift them to people. A, a uterus full of mints. Because yeah, that's where it like, thrives. Have it in like a, a waterized test tube, a big like container, so it's like living. And then put wheels on the bottom, and then you can just give it to people, yeah. and push it around like that, and say, here's my mints. <laughs> yeah. Just think about it. Just, don't, take it to don't, Listen, don't make a decision now, but, but just think about it. <laughs> <laughs> we should sell his mints. How much? How much would you guys pay for a... Um, in a uterus? No, probably in, in more likely in a plastic container. You could be like a butcher. We'll have to wait for it to cool down, though. It is quite hot. Yeah, it gets a bit thick and hot. <laughs> oh, Brown. Oh, He's Brad. having a good time. He spoke My to a Brad. girl today. He's had another date. Yeah, dude, she's the one. He's having weekly date. Stop. <gasps> okay. Here we Next, go. Question Next question is from Ed Boy Con. Um, what did your partner's parents say when you guys told them what you did for work? So when you said you were social media content creators, well, you know, scat porn people. They knew before, like, because Mon told them about me, and then so she told them what I did, and yeah, they were fucking heaps, heaps cool about it. Cool. More, very understanding, more so than my own family, mum. <laughs> yeah holy shit i got yeah exactly very open open-minded and accepting of it so very good tick ticked that box next question is from mass depending mass where he's triple a yeah it's definitely depending where he's from i'm not <laughs> sure or if she's from mm. um when are you guys going to go on some alien hunting trips that you spoke of about in the past yeah so sorry that we didn't even end up doing that we we're fucking, gonna do it yeah oh yeah we are but i don't want to give you guys a date and get your hopes up 
Because then if it falls through, then we feel bad. Don't and we? what if we don't see any? We just yeah. go there for three days. We'd probably end up getting fucked up one of the nights. Oh, dude. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I'd, we'd, we'd bring psychedelics, I think. And then we'd just be filming the bla- black sky and thinking that we're seeing aliens. Going, yeah, holy dude, shit. Dude, we, we wouldn't dude, be able to like know dude, if it was reality Imagine or being on fucking acid out in the middle of nowhere under the stars. Well, Terrence yeah. McKenna. Out in says Chinchilla. That's the way to do it. Yeah. Um, we did it out in the fucking forest with him. Yeah, yeah, I do remember that. It wasn't quite enough, so we didn't all hallucinate. But you're walking around the perimeter of the house with an axe. Oh, I do. Remember that. Oh, fucking fuck, hanging out with you guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was fucked. Yeah, but fun though, because yeah, it was outside. Yeah. That leads perfectly into the next question, which is from Dylan. Um, Michael, how many brain cells do you think you've lost from all the drugs you've done in the past? More Man, than 70%. I reckon it's definitely fucking slowed shit down. More than 70%. You know, there was a study. <laughs> he's lost more than 70%. I can't Blueberries confirm. heal him back though. No, no, no. They only stop the further degeneration of your remaining cells. You've no, lost, you you've can lost get 70%. more cells from blueberries. You've lost 70% of your uh, brain capacity. <laughs> you know, there's a new study from the UK that um, says if you drink only two standard drinks a day, your brain ages by 10 years across yeah, I've heard a lifetime. Like before, but 10 Holy years. shit. And I reckon, shit. dude, I reckon our brains are so fucked, cunt. We, imagine how, how successful we'd be if we still had the brains when we were fucking 20, cunt. If we hadn't done the damage from like 18 to 30. Because for certain that stopped the quickness, mm. the creativity, being able to talk to people. I can't like you know when you imagine pictures in yeah, your I head. Can't, yeah, I can't. I can't see anymore. the pictures anymore. <laughs> I did, just, our imagination. I can't remember like my destroyed. dad or my mom. I just know I have one. Yeah, what the fuck? Close your boring. eyes. Do me a favor, everyone at home. Close your eyes and picture your mum. Can you see? Is it just a flash image or is it a, someone that stays there? For me, it's just a flash image. I see like a blank wall, like a tsh, and then she's gone, tsh, gone. Comment what do you see, comment you, Matt? Well, um, you, you're a good example of not drug abuse. So can you see your mum when you think about her? Yeah. Yeah, what are you thinking about? What's she doing? What's she wearing? <laughs> <laughs> Next oh. question. Oh, sorry. Um, Daniel Harrison said, uh, can I get an update on the rats? I'm pretty sure we covered that though. Yeah, they are um, gro- they're massing. The rats are massing. Oh, man. Next question is from Max Edwards. Uh, do you guys regret the foot tattoos? No. Not at all. No, I was saying today, I wish I went all the way to the end of my toes. Yeah, there's no way fuck that was such a painful day that was so fucking painful. Right, yeah worst day ever vomited but worth it in the I don't, we don't regret any of the tattoos they're just tattoos like it's just a fucking tattoo oh it's on you forever yeah so it was a heap of shit Matt's got that nose for the rest of his life it's beautiful yeah though. it's a good nose oh, thank god um, next question of Joseph Colmer depending on where um, it's from he asked if you guys know much about the NFL and what are our thoughts on Tom Brady Tom Brady returned to the NFL recently to do yes, one more season I heard about that we I don't used, get too big I used, to, I used to in my early not even early in my teenage years I was obsessed with the game Madden NFL and fucking was so into gridiron before anyone else in Australia before it was like a thing I've never heard of Tom Brady before but yeah, I've don't really watch it anymore. Just a sports eh? star. Don't really fucking. What was yeah, that a liked question? Oh wow, wow, there you go. Lots of people want to know. Yeah, no, we, I, we don't really follow it much anymore. We watch a Super Bowl. We'll have it on the background while we're fucking having a bit of a chuckle together. <laughs> Oi! <laughs> All right, and the final question is from J C Pablo. Um, just Pablo, mate. You don't need to put some fucking Spanish accent on it, right? That is so racist. Always. That- that was a bit just, just Pablo <laughs> fuck okay. off JC Pablo fuck is Michael growing that moustache because he's finally making the leap to amateur scat porn you would oh fuck <laughs> I get it this is fully porn <laughs> yeah, yeah, you are. oh my god no wonder you wanted oh. to smear that shit throughout your beard yeah holy shit yeah I don't know what I'm doing with this <laughs> I've what just realised now Because we got the Manscaped shavers And I've stopped going to the barber You can make funny designs I just fucking realised We're grown men We are In our 30s And what Early 30s <laughs> What We did the other day Is not right for grown men I did not men. do it I'm not a part just of that Just Matt 
Come on. You, you got to not think about it. Just don't think about it. Yeah, I know. That's what I will continue to do <laughs> after this. But sometimes it's just funny to sit down and think. Have a reflect. We're fucking th- within our 30s now. And farts are so funny. I think they never don't get funny. Really? Do six-year-olds laugh as hard as we do at farts? Yeah. I guess if one of their mates was getting up <laughs> full of his fucking cheeks apart. Dude, think you- about like we've hung out with heaps of old people before. <laughs> They piss themselves when you rip a fart. Even the photographer today, Phil, fucking legend. Oh my Michael god! Michael farted, and then he like felt real comfortable, and he farted by the end. He let one rip, and it shocked James, Matt. <laughs> it was so loud. So yeah, farting makes other people comfortable to fart. So we're changing the world. world. One step at a time, Mister Brown. All you have to do is keep walking. Brown, did you get that? No. <laughs> that was heavy shit. Oh, I think it's time for German hot you burgers. German hot you burgers. German hot you burgers. Oh, it's exciting. I just realized I get to hit one of you. Yeah, dude. <laughs> I get Did it to- hurt last week. <laughs> yeah, I. Oh. oh, he's got a mark still. Can Holy you show shit. that? That was like seventy percent. Holy just got shit! A oh my god, it's bruised. Has it? Yeah, dude, they're no joke. You fucked my... I had a bruise around the butterfly for over a week. <laughs> All right, you ready, boys? Here we go. This is a German segment where I either say... Where I say a sentence and it's either complete bullshit, made up sounds, or it is a German segment. They have to vote on what it was. Person who gets the least amount right by the end gets hit by that wooden spoon as hard as I fucking can. As hard as I fucking can. <sighs> Number one. Grückwelt Schlittweiß. <clears throat> Try that again. Grückwelt Schlittweiß. No. It's not. Yeah, not it's German. Not. Oh, wait. Don't follow me. It is German. It is. Yeah, I say no, he says yes. It is German. It is not German. One nil to the brown Fuck. town. Brown town. So I really got to warm my jaw up, eh? Brown town. Yeah, it's town. a foul, foul, foul language. All right, number two. <clears throat> Flexstop platten behind. Flexstop platten behind. Oh, fuck. You are doing good. There's not much Irish today. <gasps> I reckon that is not German. <laughs> I'm trying to fuck with us. I'm going to say it is German. Ooh, one all. It is not German. Hello, hello, Myla. Hello, my fly. Hello, my fly. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. Number three, one all. <clears throat> Mit Pferden schlafen. Mit Pferden schlafen. No. I'm going to go that That's is German. Nonsense. That's disgusting. That is definitely German. That's real. Put it down. <laughs> <laughs> it means sleep with horses. Oh, wow. It is German. <laughs> that is fucked up. Mit Pferden like schlafen. What's horse? Witchcraft. Pferd. Flap. Pferd. Felt. P.F. Pferd. Pferd. Oh, I'm fuck. I gotta pick my game up. <laughs> two oh, one to the brown. Two one you to need the to brown. Win one more. <laughs> two one to the brown. D- oh, I didn't give you a chance to guess what it was. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. <sighs> Here we go. Number four. The victory. Number four. Two one. Matt Brown. Gefroren der Pissut. Gefroren der Pissut. That's Irish. There's no way that's German. I'm gonna say it is German. I'm going for victory. Don't. Don't you fucking let me down. It is German. <laughs> what? You are fucking yes. with me. It Hurrah. is German, baby. That is insane. The Germans can confirm it means frozen piss hat. Gefroren <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> piss hoot. Oh, no. Okay, just do it quickly. I want it. No, done. wait. Well, let's do the last one just for fun, eh? What's the score? If you get this, if you... What about... If you oh, guess wait. it right what it means, yeah. if it is German, then you get three points. That's if it is really? German and he guesses it right. Yeah, that's correct. But it could not be German. Am I on two? No, 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 no. I'm no, saying no. if you guess oh. what this one means, if it is German, you get three extra points. This is where the stone... Okay, here we go. Okay. Mit toten Vogeln spielen! Mit toten Vogeln spielen! You have to say yes for your chance to win. That's how this game works. You don't reckon it is? I'm going to say yes with you because that means our scores stay the same. I'm fucking Is that smart. good? Is he being full fucking science? Look, it's allowed and it is science. Yeah, yeah. So it you have to science. say yes for any chance of winning this because if you say no and get it right, you only get one point. But if you say yes, you can get two. 
Oh, fuck. If you get it right and but guess it. But then I lose. All you right. got to guess it though. So. All right, I'll guess it and say, no, it's, it's, it is German. Yeah, you've got to say yes. All right. So I will say yes as well. It is German. It is German. Oh. And Matt, would you like to care first guess at what it could possibly mean? Can I hear it one more time, please? Mit Torten Vogeln spielen! Spielen! Mit Torten Vogeln! Vogeln spielen! I don't know. I'm going to say I urinate on the carpet. Michael? Feeding the sparrows. Very close. It means play with the dead birds. Bullshit! Oh, that was close. Michael wins. That is. I reckon that's the <laughs> same. <laughs> Give it to him. That is the <laughs> same, sort of. No, it's not. It is play with sort the dead of the same. birds. And what did you say? Swim with the sparrows. Sparrows, <laughs> sparrows are dead birds sometimes when they die. Spar I'd rather when take the hit die, just yeah. to prove that you lost. No, wait, that was... Fuck, can we scissors, paper, rock? <laughs> no. Oh, I was just trying to, like, I guess, grab my way out of the... Matt punishment. sort of wants to be If you're upset hit. and feel like you've been robbed, I will take a hit with you. Nah, oh, really? Yeah. Double hit, yeah, I'll let you... Get I some... accept the double hit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, That's the kind go. of friend I just remember oh, that... fuck! Remember that friendship. I accept the double hit. Oh, no. It Swing with hardness and pain. of German... Oh, oh, please. oh, oh you fuck. haven't been practicing your German. Kill word. him! I'm sorry! I'm Kill sorry! Kill him! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry! <laughs> oh, dude, it sucks! <laughs> oh! Okay, stop! Oh my Brown god! Town. Look at this route! Look at this! Dude, dude, there's it's goosebumps! Numb. There's oh, I need goosebumps! A piss. I need, I need a piss. I need a piss. Would you like some? Yeah. I have to pee. Well, let's not do the spot that was you did it last time because that was quite freaking. Please go flat. Let the rats oh, in. I regret that. Let the rats oh. in. Fuck. Oh. And that's what you boys mm. get, man. Mm. You gotta pick up your German, baby. Oh. Michael really is pissing blood right now. Yeah. My leg is still on fire. Oh. oh look at Michael. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Browns came down at a bit of an angle, so it's more of a bludgeon for the Isn't brown. It? I thought this one was more flat. That one was bludgeon. <sighs> oh, All right. Okay, there you go. Let's never. Let's, let's, don't, let's, let's not do it talk next week. about it. Let's honestly not talk let's about do that it. next week. No, I don't want to do doubles. Let's forget about that. I don't want it, that feeling. I want it to go away. P.O. Box? Okay, guys, this is a P.O. Box segment where we open oh, all sure. the shit you guys send us to our P.O. Box. If you want to send us something, we'll open it's one. P.O. Box. Oh, I'll leave that one. Hey! P.O. Box, take, Box 256 Tagum, 4018 Queensland, Australia. We open everything live. So send away, okay? This is crazy. We don't know what's in these packages, Mr. Brown. Oh, wow. It's full Australia. You open that really aggressively. Someone we have a Vegemite thingy-majiggy. A Vegemite thingy-majiggy? Well, what is it, baby? A Vegemite lid. And a Vegemite sign. What does that say? Okay. That doesn't look good. Dude, I have no idea what oh, that my is. Eyes it says are stinging. Not come. My eyes not are come. stinging right now. Oh, yeah, not come. Dude, that's some sort of gas in that and it's getting into our lungs. Have a look at that. Really? Not come, yeah. Oh, Fuck this you. Is. Oh, dude, there's weird pants. Dry hot glue. It's dry hot glue. Thank you. Okay. Someone sent us dry hot glue. Here you go, man. Have a look. Yeah, I'm good. Come on. I don't want to. Dude, this is <laughs> freaky. Oh, this is good. This is a good. Oh, box so far. <laughs> Matt Brown. Huh? Oh, some games, some Xbox One games. Which ones are they? FIFA 15, 14, and 16. You don't have those. I don't have an Xbox, so Michael will have to play. I'm it. not sure what's in this apart from old FIFA games. I figured you liked FIFA, and I don't really care if you think they're shit. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you can play them if you want don't see why or use them to create your thing there will be better things in the future <laughs> no oh, i love fifa that's not bad that's a good fucking that is package. very good this Weird is from shit. at andrew underscore av underscore spotter thank Thanks, you dude. very much Andy. Thanks, dude what i a... think fifa is awesome actually michael likes fifa too what a unique and interesting box that was yeah michael can fucking your... plays all the time now can i have your phone yeah of can course you can man photo. And we got a GSC shirt. A Green, GSC? Green Street Hooligans. Actually, it's CSC. <laughs> <laughs> Sh show us it. Uh, 
Here you go. Have the shirt too. He just I guarantee he would have just fucking gone into his closet and grabbed out a shirt and put it in the package. Dude. Good on him. Good on him. All right, oh, here we have used. Oh shit. Oh, that was weird. Here we have a letter. Okay. Um I don't know if it's always hard to read these because you just don't know what words there are going to be on it. I'm wondering if this guy's got something to do with concrete. Dear Marty and Michael, quickly read this. This is a war letter to Matt Brown. Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> Ask him if he wants to say sorry to me and, and he can throw the letter in the bin slash rip it up or cut the clip and let Matt quickly read the letter and I will take it as still war, like war with Germany. And he's got some other words. I he's can't got say. some other words you can't say. <laughs> And there's another part to this. Whoa, it's a big letter. Oh, it's to address to you, Matt Brown. We're probably going to have to fucking... Oh, yeah. <laughs> I just saw some of it. Oh. I just saw some of it. Have a read in silence. I want to see Michael's expression. Do you want me to read it? No, 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 no. Definitely not. It's far it's too not fucked. Really. We ain't fucking adding or cutting shit. That's what I'm saying. I haven't even read it yet. <laughs> Matt's being firm. <laughs> yeah, he is. Matt's being firm oh. with Andrew. Ooh. Oh, this isn't Andrew though, right? We don't even know this person's name. No, this is the new one. But I think it's the one that's been having the ongoing battle yeah, with Matt. definitely. Definitely is. <laughs> what, has he got cancer or something? That's <laughs> 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 chuckling. <laughs> Imagine if there weren't even any words on it. He was just looking at that piece of paper. <laughs> Wow, there's um. Can I have it? Oh yeah, do you want read it at the end. No, no, no. I, I just want to show Michael some. Um, oh, there is some that. real hate there. <laughs> he really does not like you, does he? Yeah, there's some um, there's some <laughs> choice words and oh, stuff in here. <laughs> Especially <laughs> on the first page, it makes me wonder if he is truly angry. Ooh. I feel sad for you, dude. I feel feel sad for you. <laughs> oh, okay, enough. Feelings. That is fucked. Yeah, All but right, we'll um, put this down here. Yeah, give us a. Let's put it over here in the safe. Oh, he's being firm. He's being firm. You could have been a photographer today if you stuck with it. You could have been Phil. And I couldn't because I would have been at wholesome. You could have been Phil f taking photos of us today, having a fucking great time. You would have done a huge fart and made us laugh. Anyway. Yeah. But, uh, but if I did that, then we would not have a podcast. Well, we wouldn't do yeah, this we, anyway. We, we probably would have started it even earlier, to be honest with you. Because you'd have all the cameras from photography. Yeah, and you would be, um, you wouldn't, you could work around your schedule and not um, your employer's schedule. So mm. let that settle in. <laughs> <laughs> Time of the prank call! I can't. I remember a couple of weeks ago. That's Rhonda. Rhonda lost her wallet at a pub. Proceeding hell on Rhonda. Proceeding <laughs> hell on Rhonda. That's what they call me in primary school. <laughs> 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 <She's in progress>. <laughs> <laughs> Matt liked that one. He didn't want to like it, but he liked it. Oh, okay. All right, so go. we've plant so we've planted a wallet. Okay, Rhonda's wallet there at the pub that we're prank calling right now. So James went and dropped it off. Okay, so here we have Rhonda's wallet. Uh, Ron does wallet. Lost my 18 plus card. We filled it with condoms and tampons, so they think she's real fucked. Some lube, a bottle cap, a bit of gum, just a real sick bitch's wallet. Hey, I was found this behind one of the poking machines in the in the um, gaming room. All right, so sweet. yeah, let's Thank chuck it to so you much. guys. No worries. So we're gonna call them now. As Rhonda, and Rhonda's going to be outraged that there's some of her money's missing. Because we put 20 bucks cash in. I don't think that was in the little clip that I filmed earlier today. There's 20 bucks cash in there. But she's going to say that there was 50. <laughs> oh, where's that money gone? <laughs> How strange is that? Huh? All of a sudden, the money's not in there. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, my God, dude. Here we go, 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 here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. <laughs> Matt Brown, you coward. I haven't answered the phone. Seriously, so, so, so.
Hi, Madison speaking. Hey, Madison. How are you going? Uh, look, my name's Rhonda. Uh, I caught a couple of weeks ago because I left my wallet um, in the parkies, right? And I was just wondering, is anyone handed in a wallet uh, to your establishment? I've been look, trying to find it around the house last week and I just can't seem to find it. Uh, no, we haven't got any, sorry. Can you please, like, ask the manager or something? Because you just, you can't even, you don't even know, do you, really? No, we haven't had anything handed in, sorry. Is, can you, can you, are you serious right now? Like, I'm, honestly, I'm trying so hard, like, <laughs> listen. Hello? All right, we're going to try a different pub. I'm going to dial down the drunkness to begin and with. It could be the pink Roxy wallet could be at this pub. Okay, we didn't... There's Yeah, this is confusing because there's two pubs very close to each other. So we might have fucked up anyway. <clears throat> Seriously. Good evening, Hotel Shannon speaking. Hey, Shannon. How you going? Um, my name's Rhonda. Um, I came into your establishment um, like earlier today. And I've lost, I've lost my uh, wallet. Has and I was just wondering, has anyone had it in their wallet? Uh, what was your name, honey? Um, so my name's Rhonda. R O N D A H H. Uh, gosh, all right. Give me two seconds. I'll have a look around. Where, which area were you in? I think it was sort of been as down at the parkies. If I can remember correctly, but I'm not 100% sure. That's okay. I'll oh, have a quick look for me. you. Okay, thank you so much. Seriously. Uh, so what the fuck? Hello? What the fuck is that talking? Is that, is that what they do now? They elevate the music. Awesome perks they have some bitch. Special offers and events. Talking about special events, huh? Join today's free. Don't you fucking leave, Matt Brown. Hey, sweetie, you there? Hello? Hi, we haven't had a wallet handed in. You haven't had... It's the pink... Okay, let me... Well, just in case... <laughs> Leave me your phone number. Yeah, that's great. It's a it's a pink Roxy wallet. You know pink the brand Roxy wallet. Roxy wallet, and it's got about fifty dollars cash in it, and I kind of need that to pay for the kids' school excursion. So it's it's saying hands in. Make make sure you give me a call, okay? Because I will do. What's your they phone won't, number? They won't they won't be able to go to the yeah. uh, to the farm next week. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, that's... Uh, give me your phone number and if it turns... Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, of course. Okay, let me one sec. I just got a phone on my phone. So hard. Fucking double numbers. Um, where is it gone? Is it... Hello? Hi. Uh, sorry, one second, huh? Okay. Uh, zero four. Zero four. Uh, two one. Two one. Three four nine. Oh, Three four nine. Me. Nine five two. Nine five two. Two. Okay. It's, it's just just I might have to come back in to later tonight if no one's called yet. Because I do need a wallet, otherwise I can't continue okay. to we continue to drive. I, I, it's got my license in it too, so I can't drive um, too far without it. Do you know? Do you know what I mean? No, no, that's okay. If it turns up, we'll call you. That's great. I'm okay. Okay. I might, okay, I might come down and have a look anyway. What's it like there for dinner? You guys doing dinner? I was just in gla enjoying a, a glass of Shiraz with my dinner. Honey, um, I'm going to be honest with you, talking to you on the phone, I think you've maybe had a couple of drinks. So I probably me? recommend not coming down to well, the Excuse me. You sound, can, are you saying... That's assault. You just assaulted Pardon? me. You basically just assaulted me verbally. And my uncle's studying to do the lawyer, okay? And okay. If, you, if I come down there and bring my uncle down, 
He's starting to do lawyer. Okay, okay you don't need so, to yell, honey. So you need to yourself. back up it's because a I've enjoyed a, a one or two glasses of shiraz. I can't understand what you're saying, hun. I've had, I said, listen closely, sweetheart, because this is getting okay. ridiculous. This is getting, honestly, I've never you. been spoken to in such a fashion. You assaulted me. You assaulted me. You've just verbally assaulted me, okay? Wow. You said you said I'm too drunk to come into your establishment, and you don't even know my name. I have your name. You've given it to me and your phone number. You witch. Okay, darling, I'm going to go now. I'm coming down to see my okay, war, right, darling? You, really, you, but you, I'm going to hang you, up the I can't now. believe the service at your house is so shit. I'm coming down like a ton of bricks with my uncle, okay, darling. I'm going She's to hang up the My way. uncle's coming around. Fuck, it's so hard to remember the characters. Sometimes I'm just like in that character. It's just a one-time thing sometimes. <laughs> oh, it's just a demon that comes. Yeah, it, 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 it is housed in me for a short while and then it departs and oh, another demon Well takes done it. to that girl. She handled <laughs> that well. Totally, she assaulted you. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Uh, do we need Connor to bleep the hotel name? Yeah, bleep yeah. the hotel name. Connor, yeah, can yeah. you but please that, hotel them? That made up for, I reckon the first place... Is caught on to the joke. <laughs> All right, um, well, the fuck. motherfuckers, the fucking dogs. They said just, they, they probably got the wallet and they went, "This is fucked," and just threw it out. Oh, <laughs> well, it was so haggard looking. Like, or maybe someone told them, like, "Hey, hey, have you seen this? You guys are on the fucking fully actual." What we need to do is go to a new pub, fuck, do it again, Let's and leave. and but not have to call them prior. So. So that they just have the yeah, wallet. Yeah, they have the wallet. Let's just leave like 10 wallets. Okay, so next Shit week, I can't believe the wallet thing didn't work. They fucking, they must be onto us. But we'll fucking try again next week. We're going to do the wallet thing and uh, to a brand new pub so they won't know that we're p- fucking pranking them. I still enjoyed that one so much. Yeah, that was very good. <laughs> You've assaulted me. <laughs> oh, wow. She handled it well. Thank you for yeah, that. Yeah, she's very good employee. Let me tell you. Suck on my doodle, huh? Oh no! It's time to leave. <laughs> you want to suck on my titties? You stupid fucking cunt! That's <laughs> Ronda Horny. <laughs> Oh fuck! Oh. And now Michael will leave you with this parting message. Oh shit! I guess if you st- if you step in front with your feet, you'll always keep stepping with your feet front. Oh, that's tried and tested. That it's called walking, and everyone does that. So very powerful message. Thank we you. are the best. We are look the best. It's it's very clear at this point. We are the best. We are. The best. We are the best. We are definitely the best. We're the best. We're better than the rest. That's for sure. We're, we're the, the best. best. We're the best. We're the, we're best. the best. Matt, say it. Yeah, you, you never say it. You didn't say it last what week. What are you, too cool, huh? Too cool to be... Say we're the best. Grossly overconfident about our abilities? Hmm? <laughs> we're the best, aren't we? are the we? best, Matt Brown. We're getting aggressive. Say we're, we're the we're best. We're getting a bestive. We're the best, best... <laughs> Best. We're the best. best. We're the best. Best. We're the best. We're the best. We're the best. Whisper we're the best. at least. Say we're, we're the best. best. We're the best. Why? You best. can't hear it if we're I whisper. Yeah, you can. It's in the ringworm. We're the best. 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 We're oh, my little brown. Best, huh? Brown. My little we're the brown. best. My little brown, darling. We are the best. The side. The side pumps the blood to the tip. <laughs> we are the best. We are the best, brown. Ha <laughs> <laughs>